guys, Rachie Bob here and welcome to this week's episode of Ask Rachie Bob. For Apple Snaps, an iPhone theory, and talk of how your life can change with Siri. Into The Sims, but there's real life too. She loves to answer questions from all of you. Ask Rachie Bob. First question this week comes from King Famadeer here on YouTube. Have you ever been Rickrolled? I don't think I have. If I have, it was a really, really, really long time ago. Next question comes from at hello neil123 on Twitter. Do you watch Modern Family or Gogglebox? I don't watch Gogglebox, but I do watch Modern Family. I'm waiting for Netflix, hello Netflix, to put up the next season on Netflix, obviously. Next question comes from Derek Stergill here on YouTube. You should do a meetup in America when you come over again. Question of the week, ever broken a bone or anything like that? I certainly should do a meetup in America, you're right, and I will in the future, hopefully. And no, I have never broken a bone. I've never been in hospital, touch wood, for anything overnight, apart from when I was burst. Next question comes from at Connor O'Shea on Twitter. What are you looking forward to most regarding the meetup? I'm most looking forward to meeting you and at Beyond Sims. I am looking forward to meeting you guys the most, although it is the thing that puts the fear of God into me the most as well, <laughs> just because it's kind of weird because like people know what I look like, but I am like being watched and I don't know who's watching. Do you know what I mean? Like it's kind of scary, but I really like meeting people because it helps me put a face to the YouTube name or Twitter handle and then I can like visualise who I'm talking to and also I remember better who I'm talking to. So I'm really looking forward to meeting you guys, chatting with you all and just hanging out for the afternoon. It's going to be really cool and hopefully some if some surprises that we're working on play out I'll be quite excited for those too, as I imagine you will be. And the final question this week comes from SquareTable22 here on YouTube. Do you believe it's a waste of money to buy the new generation of smartphone series every year, or even every two years, i.e. the Samsung Galaxy S series or the iPhone Mate series? Samsung, yes. iPhone, no. Totally worth all your money. But actually, on a non-biased note, I think it's completely personal preference and I know that I say that a lot because it's and it sounds like a bit of a cop out but it really is personal preference whether it's worth it to you depending on how much money you have how much you can afford to spend how much you use your phone what you use your phone for how vital the things that the phone do are to you there's so many factors to work into that answer but I'd love to hear your thoughts on that in the comments I think if you are like happy with the one you have and it's still working you can use it and use it and use it and there's no need to upgrade unless you need like a better camera or whatever the new one has to offer and you can get a reasonable deal on it then it's totally worth it but I don't think you should stick to a rigid I'm going to upgrade every single year unless there's some reason that you need to or it's cheaper to do that. Thanks for all your questions guys! Another Ask Rachel Bop has come to the end. If you want to get your questions in for next week you can ask in the comments here on YouTube. You can also ask over on Twitter using the hashtag Ask Rachel Bop. Thank you so very much for watching. I love you and I'll see you in my next video. I know that all sounded sarcastic but it wasn't. I was quite genuine. Bye!